So this is the alley of 2124 East 3rd Street. Back to the three-stall garage. A lot similar to the one on 2124 East 5th Street. The door is locked, no key for it. Walk up some stairs. Not much of a yard. Back of the house. The roof. Nice cinder blocks on the roof, pretty high. Neighboring homes. Up some wooden stairs. Come in through the back door. Have a great little mud room. This is just that room that's the other. Old blue stone, and then this is underneath a uh, probably post little heater there. And as we get into the actual host part of it, here's a a bathroom slash the laundry room. Little makeshift bedroom, non-legal of course, because no conforming windows, no egress. Old boiler, water heater looks fairly new. Bluestone basement, there's the main water. Basement looks like it's in sound condition. Electrical looks like it's fairly updated. I believe this is 200 amp service and it's, it's ran very clean. Yeah, 200 amp service and the wires are very clean. Old tub, they did some remodeling. Definitely looks much better than the last time I was in it. Then as you go up the stairs, this is was laminate floors here. Now they put in some hardwood that looks really nice. A little bit of a view of the lake. Might get worse as those trees fill in. Hardwoods do look great. They put in this little island here. Little bar area. Lots of light switches, but I can't figure out what they turn on. Still nothing. There we go. Very small kitchen. Very narrow. Once you open up the dishwasher, kind of takes care of the whole entire room. Kitchen is very small on this one as well. Nice tiled floors here. Old original hardwood here. Not too crickety. Pretty nice. Updated fireplace. Decent sized living room. And then right around the corner is where we came up from. Up the stairs. Now we'll head up. Well, first I'll show you the outside. It is a shared driveway out here. You share that driveway, that's the neighbor's car. Little across the street view. But a little short, short driveway if you wanted to use this way. And right behind these stairs is where we came up from the basement. There's the kitchen, dining room, and the living room. Now we'll head up. Hardwoods look great. These wood stairs look awesome. Some of the windows updated. This one's fairly updated. They updated this bathroom since um, they purchased it. A little bit of view of the lake again. Kind of a look at the roof line. There's the stairs we came up. 
Here's probably what you'd use as the master bedroom. It's definitely the biggest. You could have a hearse closet here. And then a his closet over here. Yeah, and this looks like a king size bed, just to give you an idea of what the, the room size is. There's the bathroom, a little closet. Another good size bedroom. Probably a twin size, actually that is a twin size bed. Decent little closet in here. Hardwoods look great. Fairly new windows in here as well. This is the smaller bedroom, very tiny. It's empty, but it's uh, not big at all. Uh, this would be great for nursery crib. But it's not a big room at all. That was a crack. They put some wallpaper over it. It looks very, really good now. Pin up the stairs. Hardwood. They put in some carpet here. Nice view of the lake as you go up. This room they did a very nice job with. This is that upper floor that I said was kind of an odd layout where it had a heat source. They put in a bathroom. Put in some really nice hardwoods. Exposed the brick. Kind of a low ceiling fan. My head would hit this, but not the light. I'm not that tall to hit the light. Might be able to configure a, this to be a master bedroom as well. Go all the way to the top floor. Then you have a true master. A low ceiling line for a guy at the, at the toilet. They put the shower way up top, which is nice. So pretty much anyone tall enough, pretty tall, will be able to use this as a functional shower. No mirror ever, just because it's angled so bad. Then we'll head back down. A little electrical service for up here. Once again, bigger bedroom. Maybe the master bedroom, unless you use the upstairs. Pushes out a little bit, but every house does shift. Nice tile floors and tile surrounding that. And this one does have a main floor bathroom as well. There's the front entryway. Living room. And they did a nice job. This was, like I said, this was laminate before. Now they put in some hardwoods. And there's the bathroom. And there's the stairs to go down. Looks like a closet door, but stairs to go down. And main floor bathroom. Nice tile floors in here too. And a little back deck area. And let John and or I, John or I know if you have any other questions and we'll be happy to help you. Hopefully this video will help. Here's a little side door too. Yeah, the kitchen is just a little bit on the smaller side if that's a big issue.